Good evening, good evening, good evening. Not with that, not with that, not with that. Crazy. Welcome back to the channel. Here we are again on Puzzle Combat for the Raid Tournament. Just so people know, there is a uh, undercover gala event out. Uh, it probably is worth doing now that they finally, after the first one where they had, uh, oh, near the secret. Fancy seeing you here. I thought I was going in alone. You can never be too careful. These parties really get out of hand when the com they compete for that number one operative spot. True enough. Now what's your get up for today? Getting into the spirit of some Viking vibes. Their glory shall be mine. How about you? I'm here to climb up that crooked corporate ladder. Let's go and infiltrate this party. Yeah. Sorry, terrible accents. Huh? Um, yeah, so there's this undercover thing. I think it might be a new hero for it because I don't remember this football player he being here before. Maybe he was. Who is it? Go back. Who are you? Kurgan, who's now in a football kit because that's more practical than the weapons he had before. Uh, 255 damage, delayed attack. Delayed attack's quite... We see anyway, damage over turns. I thought that he delayed their attack. Uh, 180, yeah, that's quite a big attack boost. Yeah, it seems pretty reasonable. Uh, I think the others are all as was, but they have safely removed all of the ones that were already here, which is quite nice. Kathleen, no, it's, yeah, Kathleen's been... Yep, so they've changed them all around, which is good, because it, it was a bit rubbish that you could get people you couldn't actually use. So, undercover gala, 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 I'm going to go gala. Gala is the English pronunciation. Now, do you think Americans call it gala? Am I, am, I, am I imagining that? I might be. If I am, I do apologise. Uh, anyway, we're here for the actual attack. Oh, let's just see if my defences have held up, have done anything yet. Uh, e, so they haven't worked out very well at all. That's, that's a shame. Disappointing. Right then, so uh, into the battle, no greens, so you should have a blue tank. I did put a blue tank, didn't I? Yeah, I did put a blue tank. So you should have a blue tank, uh, yellows and purples. Interesting setup, this one. Um, obviously going going big on the counter-attackers here. I'm just going to go with what i got, I think. Um, three, they, they've got more yellows than they've got purples, which give me an edge there. Uh, yeah, it's going to be down to the boards, I think, this one. And they're not looking very good at the moment. Uh, right, let's see. It's one of those, if I blow this one up. There we go. That's it. Uh, blow ups, there we go. Oh, that's hope. Oh, I thought I might take out their Rana then. I was really hoping to be rid of one of the purples uh, early on. There we are. Purples are gone. That leaves me with some nice spaces. Only really got one to, t to take out now. So, there's an and as they, obviously they can't heal. Not that they're a healer anyway, but uh, they are doomed. Doomed, Captain Main Rolling. Doomed. Um, just work my way through them. Lots of stuff. There we go. Oh, it's been a funny few days. I did, I did, no, I did a video brief, briefly yesterday. Gary Lineker, eh? <sighs> Pointing out the truth and getting into trouble for it. No, yeah, it's, what I don't get is it's, it's like the most mild criticism of the government I've ever heard. And it's like, it's, it's actually true. It, it It's quite accurate as a description of the government's policy that it... It mirrors the language used in 1930s. Uh, in, the, in Germany in the 1930s, it does. It talks about an invasion. It talks about all this stuff. And then all these people who've gone on and on about, ah, oh, freedom of speech, freedom to have an opinion, you should be able to say what you think. The minute somebody states what is actually just simply a fact, they all throw their toys out the pram. I've just, it's been shocking in the UK. I mean, just, yeah, just, I, I really, I mean, like a lot of people in life, the one thing I really can't stand is hypocrites. Uh, and it's it's just the hypocrisy of it all. It's just ridiculous um, how people can genuinely go say say something along the lines of, you know, he's in the wrong for having an opinion. They're the same people who constantly cry about how they're champions of freedom of speech. So just driving me mad. Makes me really angry. Uh, and then unfortunately, there seems to be a lot of it going on. You know, there seems to be less and less actual... Um, actual politics um, from politicians. I don't know if anybody else has noticed this. If anybody else knows that m m more and more now, like, politicians used to do politics. Whereas now they, they all seem to be doing, like, podcasts and stuff like that. They want to be celebrities. It's like, I didn't think that was what politicians were for. I thought that's what, like, you know, entertainment was for. Ah, it just drives me mad. And I see it in the States as well. I mean, you know, you see these politicians who, who aren't doing any politicking. If politicking's a word, all they're doing is, is 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 podcasts and going. Oh, look at me! I can be a star. I can make money doing doing tours and 
going to rallies and people can come and listen to me be say my not particularly intelligent stuff. I just, yeah. I'm sure there was a time politicians actually used to do politics and actually think about what was good. Well, not necessarily good for the people, but, you know, they actually do stuff rather than come up with excuses not to do stuff, which seems to be the com common thought of theme with it all these days. Ah, oh, there we are. Anyway, um, I well, I'll, you know, as ever I say, I'll get down off my soapbox, but not really, because let's be honest, I'm continually on my soapbox these days. Uh, very hard to be anywhere much else. Um, anyway, Shrew, let's swap this one around. Let's swap in some blues. Um, and I guess that's why they call them the blues. Um, yeah. Yes, there we go. Anyway, so let's see. We've got now this red guy in the middle. Now, I think I've got that person. I don't know who they are. Uh, who are you? Chase. Ah, Chase. Like like the dog in Paw Patrol. It's true. True fact, that. Um, yeah. So, uh, Chase, let himself go. Got to be said. Got to be said. That puppy has let himself go. Get himself into all kinds of trouble. But then, police puppy, you know, if any of them was, if any of them was going to become a sort of crazy, you know, hitman, hitman killer type when they became a, a grown-up dog... You'd go with Chase. I don't think anyone could argue it. I mean, the others, well, you know, Marshall, mm, not really seeing it there, to be honest. He's a, he's more kind of, you know, how do you describe Marshall? Um, probably an accountant in later life, I would think. Rubble, pretty much, pretty much, kind of get the impression he's just going to stick with a building like, building line. He's got it. He's got it down. He's got his hat. You know, he doesn't need to change. Sky. Mm, I don't know, Sky. Where's she gonna end up? So hard to say with some of these things. Um, this one's gone with a blue healer. They got the right colour, but the wrong, uh, wrong one. But then it could be they haven't got another blue that's at the same level. So, um, and it, it may well work out for them anyway because I can't really overload um, the one they have got. Uh, personally, I would argue that the two reds next to each other isn't great. Also, one of those. Reds is a three star, so but then I looked at this guy, I think he was quite low, um, quite low experience. He possibly just hasn't developed the team that he could do with. Um, so I'm not going to be too critical here. I know I, I have a history of being critical, but the fact they've gone with the right color tank, um, makes me think that they have been paying some attention to the uh, you know, the logistics of the game. Um, yeah, that's my view. Uh, so obviously that unfortunately won't do anything for them, but it's still, I would argue, better to have a blue healer if that is your only option than to have any other colour tank. Uh, uh, sorry, a blue healer as a tank than to have a tank of a different colour. That's my personal fi feelings on this. Um, as always, doesn't mean I'm 100% right. Um, you know, I quite often make mistakes. I'm well aware of these. I Yeah. I think I think that was wasn't bad. Um, I think Notorious Viper, yeah, only level forty four, so that's fairly low level. Uh, may simply not have the bench of heroes to go with other options. Um, this one's gone down tricky route, really, because um, obviously the, this is one of those. Do I go for the tanks or do I go for the other three? Where do I stack? So I'm going to go for the other three mainly because of eight bit. Now I might well regret this. Um, obviously I'm going to be looking at taking out some of the purples first but that may not happen because this doesn't seem to be particularly forgiving looking bored at the minute uh, yeah this is going to be a defeat I think just based on the complete absence of yellow tiles in usable places um, yeah let's drop these ones in here uh, yeah this is this one is the yellow tiles I needed to sort of make things happen um, that it just isn't going to happen unfortunately uh yeah still <laughs> you know I, I don't know how many turns it's been and i haven't had a single well if i had one yellow three in a row which is never going to be enough so this is going to be not only a defeat i think this will be a crushing defeat uh oh no i managed to kill one there we are i managed to get one kill in yes um and now i've got purple tiles set up against the purples and nothing at all set up against the yellow uh, against the other purple there we are that's very helpful um might get no i didn't think it would quite kill him um mm -mm. this is one of those well there's there's nearly no point 
in me actually activating him because he'll kill himself if I activate him. But if I don't activate him, he's going to die anyway. So I'm going to do this and just see what happens. Um, see, I can't hit... If he goes off, he's going to kill himself in my 8-bit, so I may as well just hope that there's a little cascade of tiles takes one of these two out for an extra point or two, but nah, not going to happen. Um, again, just seeing if I can land one more point, but nah, didn't manage to knock anyone out. Pretty poor start, that, really. Uh, pretty poor start altogether. But never mind, there we go. It's the way it goes some days. As I say, it could be worse. I could be part of... Uh, I could be part of the conservative government, uh, or even worse, somebody who still believes in them and votes for them. Anyway, there we are. So thank you very much for watching. As ever, do please remember to like, share, comment and subscribe. And it just remains for me to say, hova, goodbye, and may death come swiftly to your enemies.